Blessings everyone, this is Chris Kendall from TheRawAdvantage.com, registered holistic nutritionist, raw food lifestyle coach, and raw chef. Today I'm excited to bring you some Halloween treats and some Halloween recipes. Let's get into it. Baby, I like it raw. Raw Advantage likes it raw. Ooh, baby, I like it raw. Yeah, baby, I like it raw. Alright guys, so it doesn't matter if you're feeling a little bit slothful and slow and just want some super duper simple treats to share. Or if you have a lot of extra energy and feel like aping around, I got a couple raw recipes for Halloween for you too. So I got you covered with both options. So before we get into that, I have a couple things I'm really excited about to share. Number one, my raw food and yoga surf adventure retreat in Costa Rica 2020. It's your last few days to get $100 off your admission up until the end of this month, the end of October. Halloween's the last day, so check out below or above to get that information. I hope you enjoy with us. It's the time of our lives. It's amazing, super fun. I love Costa Rica. And last but not least, the Raw Advantage Raw Recipes app is now available on Android. I've been waiting for this for a long time. I know you guys have too, and it's also updated on the iOS store for Apple, so you can download that above or below for each different one. They're 33% off the price from my eBooks on my site. So I hope you guys absolutely enjoy that. I'm super excited to bring it to you. It's the most easy functionality to get all my recipes in your hand. You don't even need Wi-Fi once you've downloaded it. You can pick up recipes by ingredient or by recipe name and you can add them to the shopping cart. There's a freaking Ross and food combining chart and so much more. This is my baby. I'm really excited for it. If you like the app, please rate it on the App Store, Google Play or on the iTunes Store. So I just hope you guys love it. Now, let's get into this recipe with some super simple grocery items you can find anywhere. Ooh, spooky. All right, guys, so with Halloween and trick-or-treating season and the way it's commercialized and, you know, a lot of junky foods and maybe you don't want to be passing that out to a lot of people, sometimes you just turn your lights off so no one comes, right? But if you want to give out something that is a little bit higher quality, a little bit uh, healthier for kids and they won't throw it at you or egg your house, one of the best options, I would say, is raisins. And you, know, you can get sun-made raisins, you can get them organic or conventional, but one of the good things about this brand, and I'm, I'm not sponsored by them or nothing like that, is they don't have any oil. You know, a lot of raisins have uh, preservatives or have oil on them. These ones are oil-free and they're actually pretty darn inexpensive, even the organic ones. So, you know, these little boxes are easy to hand out and kids can have something a little bit more healthy instead of just junky junk junk food. Now, probably you're not going to be passing these out. Christmas oranges, we call them here, mandarin oranges, you know, easy peel, delicious. I love smoothies, like a lot of things with them, but you can make some fun little decorations. So this is the more slothful thing. If you don't feel like being extra fancy, you can just take these little guys, take a nice little marker black if you like, draw different types of jack-o'-lantern faces on them or get creative, do whatever the heck you want. I'm gonna make a scary cat, so have a look. I'm gonna start with the eyes. Then do an upside down triangle for the nose and draw little whiskers. Then you do a mouth. She looks happy and cute, but then we add a little fangs. Ooh. Ooh. And then we do the little ears. There Boop. we have it. Done. Beautiful. <laughs> and you can have them all around. You can you know, pop them in your kids' lunch boxes, send them around, have them on display when the kids come to the door. And if the parents or the kids do like them, then you can offer them. But some people don't want the fresh stuff, you know, in this day and age, people are scared, right? But that's a fun, simple, little decorative kind of treat that you can bring out. You could also use persimmons if you like, but then you maybe don't want to eat the skin. <laughs> Alright, so now you guys are ready for the spooky monster smoothie bowls. We're gonna have two of them, so I'm gonna show you how to do it. So we're gonna start by taking some bananas. We're just gonna slice some little rounds, and then we're gonna take some green grapes, as well as some red grapes, and slice them into nice little circles as well, so that they're a little bit of, they're like irises. Put those on top of the banana slices, and then we're gonna take some blueberries and slice them in half, and put those on there for the pupils. So now you got two different colors of eyes. You can slice up as many of those as you like. 
at least Ooh, two for spooky. each bowl, right? We're gonna make two different bowls. Now put those aside and we're gonna get into making some scary, spooky Halloween mouths. So we'll take some red apples. One of my favorites is Red Delicious or Gaia for this and some uh, yellow or green apples like Granny Smith or Golden Delicious. Take your apple into and cut it out. Oh. <laughs> Fancy. <laughs> Take your apple and cut it into fours. Core out the middle and then carefully slice open a mouth into each quarter. Then what we're gonna do is you're gonna take some sunflower seeds or if you want pumpkin seeds and carefully press them into the edge of the lip so it looks like little crooked, ugly looking teeth. Keep doing it, it's a little bit tough. You might want little teeny fingers. It's fun to have little kids play along and help you out with little treats and little Halloween crafts like this, they love it. Once you've got all the teeth in, if you want, you can optionally slice the back just a little bit carefully and thinly slice one strawberry and insert it through like a nice little tongue. So now you've got the mouths, and if you like, you can serve these on a plate and just have them as little hors d'oeuvres or appetizers, little mouths and little eyes. You can even dehydrate the eyes if you want and throw them in a smoothie bowl or whatever you'd like. But if you want to make the scary monster smoothie bowl, then we're going to continue and make a smoothie bowl. So the first one that we're going to do, we're going to take six bananas and we're gonna blend those up with a whole bunch of greens. Now, my absolute favorite is a mix of arugula and spinach or just straight arugula when I'm feeling a little bit more spicy. You can add as little or as much as you want. This makes a nice green Frankenstein type monster. So we'll blend that nice and smooth. And then you have the option of mixing in, you know, a handful or a cup of red grapes, or if you want, you can throw a handful or a half a cup of raisins in there, mix it all up and then add your two eyes. For the green face, I like to add the red eyes and the red lips. Now to the second smoothie bowl. We'll take six bananas and we'll blend it with about a cup of raspberries to make a nice red rosy face. That one nice and smooth. If you want, you can mix in some green grapes into that smoothie bowl, or if you want, you can mix in some blueberries. Once that's all mixed up, you can add the eyes. This one I like to add the green eyes and the green lips so that they pop out a lot more. Now you've got two different funky, scary smoothie bowls for Halloween to share with your little ones or the big one in you. And there you have it guys. I really hope you enjoy this recipe. Share it with some young ones or the young one in you, you know? As always, thumbs up, you know, hit subscribe, hit that little bell to get more videos to be notified when the new ones come out. I put a new one out every single week. And otherwise, make sure you check out my Raw Recipes app on Android and on iOS. They're both there, they're both updated, and I think you're gonna really, really love them. As always, wishing you much. Peace, love, and seasonal fruit. Halloween. Spooky treats and recipes. Ooh, don't forget to check out my Raw Recipes playlist in the top left. The video just for you in the top right. Subscribe for more videos in the bottom right and get your three free ebooks in the bottom left. Oh gosh, I'm too Grab lazy to switch this. You guys, you know it's updated. Just click the link above or below. You want the new updated app for iPhone or for Android. You're going to love it.